Good morning. Happy Monday. Wanted to show you my morning routine. I'm going to do this as quickly as possible. Um, I am freshly showered. I've already washed my skin, my body skin, and I have oof, put on my lotion and I have you know, put on any other creams on my body skin. So now I just wanted to really show you guys some of the products that I use. So a lot of the products that I use are actually uh, Melaleuca products. So I washed my skin with this, which is the uh, one of the Renew, is in a part of the Renew line. So this is the body wash and um, it's unscented of course. It's for intensive skin therapy, it's for folks who just like keeping their skin moisturized if you have eczema or any other kind of skin issue that creates dry skin definitely want to try that um, I also use their soap which I don't have the packaging for but I'll just show you it real quick so this is the Melaleuca soap it used to have like the little Melaleuca plant on the front of it, but yeah, it's unscented and all of that, and I can use that in my nether regions. So I'm just a sensitive person, so I have to keep um, certain things out. Not that it would bother it, not that the body wash would bother it, but I just definitely make sure that I'm particular about the kinds of um, things I'm putting down there. So anyway, yeah, wash the body wash. Um, you should be using the same things that you use in your face, you should be using on your body. So you should be exfoliating your body skin and, uh, of course, moisturizing it. And with the facial skin, of course, it's going to be a little bit more, um, more products. But for my body skin, this is the lotion that I use. Again, this is a, the Renew line from Melaleuca. It's a huge bottle. All right, so I have already done some of my skincare, my facial skincare routine in the shower. I'm somebody who, um, I used to sit in front of the sink and like do all of this and then have like my bathrobe on and it'd be soaking wet or just stuff dripping down my, my arms and whatnot. And I don't really like that. So... I did two parts of my skin care, my facial skin care, in the shower already. And again, this is the uh, Sabella line. And this is the Gentle Exfoliating Cleanser. This is part of their Vitamin C Skin Defense line. I got the entire bundle. The bundle comes with the Gentle Exfoliator. You get a defense and repair treatment serum. Oh, and by the way, I love the packaging because it's recycled, recyclable materials that it comes in. So, this is the defense and repair treatment serum. It's also a part of the vitamin C line. And this is what the bottle looks like. Say Bella. It's a line, it's the beauty line through Melaleuca. And then this is the Daily Defense Cream. It's Daily Defense Cream. Yeah, that's what it says. Let's look at what that bottle looks like. So that bottle, of course, in recycled materials. Look at that. It's pretty. I like the packaging on this because it's, you know, when you think of vitamin C, you kind of think orange, yellowish. So... And then also a part of the uh, vitamin C bundle is the exfoliating mask. Now, I'm not going to do that today because I've already done two exfoliators this morning already. I've done the um, cleanser, which is exfoliating in itself. It's a gentle exfoliator. but And then I also, now this part is not part of the Melaleuca line, the Sabella line. This is actually something I got off of Grove. Um, and this is the Cuckoo and Jehovah, 
jojoba bead skin brightening exfoliator so while this one is a gentle one this one is not necessarily gentle but it's still exfoliates so this is the true exfoliator and this is my cleanser really it just has exfoliating um, properties in it so I gave myself a little facial mist but the thing you want to do when you're doing your skin routine is keep your skin moist you want to keep adding products while your skin is moist you don't want to wait till your skin dries because um, water helps drive the products into your skin so you definitely want to continue to uh, add products while your skin is wet so as soon as you get out of the shower you want to make sure that not for you just your body skin but also your facial skin you want to make sure that you are adding stuff so I'm just um, giving myself this facial mist now I got this from Trader Joe's again this is the second product that's not part of the Melaleuca line um, but this is the Trader Joe's watermelon facial mist refresh and hydrate I do like that so the so these are two items that are not a part of the Melaleuca line, the vitamin C bundle. But again, I've, I've used this in the shower. These two I use in the shower because they are things that you have to wash off. So while I'm in the shower, I might as well go ahead and wash it off. That way I don't have to do it when I get out. All right, and so now the next thing that I'm going to put on my skin on top of the facial mist is the Defense and Repair Treatment Serum. And you really only need like a couple of pumps. And that smells good. It smells just like um, any other vitamin, vitamin C. It, it kind of smells like orange. That's what it smells like. I've used other vitamin C products before. And uh, I'm going to get a couple more scoops for my neck. Now anything that you do to your face, you need to do to your entire facial skin. And your facial skin includes your ears. Go up into your hairline. I do my neck and my chest. So I put this all there. So that is the treatment serum. I am someone who likes to layer treatment serums. So I'm going to add a couple more. Let's see if I can open this door without. Okay, hold on. Hope I didn't flash y'all. Okay, so I'm gonna add two more serums to my skincare just because the more uh, serums you add on, the more hydration. Now, this one, these next two that I'm gonna use are actually from the Olay line. Um, this is the Deep Hydration Serum, it has B3 plus hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid, of course, is trending these days. But it's great because it's one of those things that helps water penetrate deeply. And I love this little, of course I just dropped it. So I'm going to have to clean it before I put it back in here. But you just rub this in everywhere. My allergies are acting up, you guys. Went for a walk yesterday, and like all of the trees and things are blooming, and that's all it takes. Okay, so since I dropped my dropper, I'm going to just pour out a little bit to put on my neck and chest. You want to make sure, again, everything that you do to your facial skin, you have to do to your neck and chest. Keep all of that skin good. Alright, so that was the Olay Deep Hydration Serum with B3 and Hyaluronic Acid. The next um, Olay product I'm use using is the Tone Perfection Serum. This is B3 and Vitamin C. So this is probably a little dupe, duplicate of what I've already, because it has Vitamin C in it. But again, I just like layering different things let me say this too your skincare routine does not have to be as excessive as mine 
your skincare routine. And I know the lady from Mix Makeup, she's probably like, be gentle with your facial skin. And you really should be. Um, so, I'm really careful about how I apply things around my eyes because later on in the day, this stuff will get in your eyes. But one of the good things that I like about Melaleuca products is that a lot of it is clean beauty. And so, you really wouldn't worry about it um, getting in your eyes. Let me find this dropper. There it is. I have to clean it before I put it back in there. All right. So, that was number what? Okay, so this was number one. The Gentle Exfoliating Cleanser. This is from the Sabella. Then I used... The actual true exfoliator, this is from Grove. This is Pi. And it's Cuckoo and Jojoba B Skin Brightening Exfoliator. So that's number two. And then I did spray on some facial mist. Facial mist is good when you're out walking or you're just put some in your car and in your purse. That way in case you uh your skin starts to feel dry throughout the day, even if you have on makeup. Having a facial mist is a good thing. Alright. And so the third thing that I... Well, the third thing was the facial mist. Then the fourth thing that I put on was this defense and repair treatment. So this has vitamin C in it. This is the Sabella line. So that's number four. Number five was the deep hydration serum. B3 plus hyaluronic acid. Hyaluronic acid is one of those things that helps... Anything that you put on after the hyaluronic acid, it helps it to seep in deeper. So the thing after the hyaluronic acid and the B3 on the Olay one, I put this Tone Perfecting Serum, which is B3 and vitamin C. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. And then, so I just did that. Now, if this was nighttime, I would have done the exfoliating mask after the true exfoliate after the pie, I would have done that, but um, you only use this a couple times a week, not every day. It's not part of your daily. All right, and so this next thing that I'm going to use is the daily defense cream. So this is just like a moisturizer. So you want to put, you want to cleanse your face, you want to exfoliate, you want to add your um, hyaluronic acid and humectants and all of the things that help keep your skin hydrated, all your serums, and then you want to kind of seal that with a cream or a moisturizer. And again, it just smells like, just smells like uh, oranges. Not as strong like orange. And if you're one of those people who are real funny about how oranges smell, then don't be worried because it's really not a whole lot of scent. That feels really good, actually. That feels really, really good. And so, and that's it. And so, see, you're not, like, spending a whole lot of time doing that. And so, even though my skincare routine technically is, like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven steps in the morning... It's really like not a lot. We've done this in less than 15 minutes. And look at there. I've got one little guy right there that is like, but mostly my skin stays clear. I um, at night put on eye cream, you know, but you keep clear skin. This is 41, you guys. Um, I'm starting to see some imperfections. Laugh lines, you know, my mustache and beard I have to make sure that I keep together. Um, you know, starting to see some aging, but that's when you don't use vi uh, sunblock and things like that. And so for this little guy that's on my face today, I'm going to do a spot treatment. So let me show you what I'm going to use. And by the end of the day, and I'll probably post that, by the end of the day, 
you won't even see this. All right, so um, my favorite thing to do when I have like little bumps is this Sunday Riley Good Jeans. It's a lactic acid treatment. And so all I do, do I have a Q-tip? I do. Now, most things that I added today, I just added with my finger. But I like to try to keep it keep it as uh, clean as possible, especially with things that are supposed to be like spot treatment so this is going on on top of my moisturizer but it's gonna do what I need it to do which is to dry out dry out this little guy see how it was a little red and stuff too so it pays sometimes to be working from home because well it literally pays to be working from home because you can walk around like that all day and let Sunday Rally like really do what it do. All right, so now my hands are breezy from all of the stuff that I've used today. And that's it, guys. Um, I really just wanted to show you this uh, Say Bella line. This is actually the first time that I'm using this. Um, so I'm going to, you know, do it for two weeks consistently and just tell you guys how I like it. Part the things that are part of the Say Bella line, the vitamin C bundle, is really four items. So that's the cleanser, gentle exfoliating cleanser, Say Bella. Then you have the treatment serum. And then you have the exfoliating mask and then you have the daily defense cream so mix makeup the lady from mix makeup she always says you apply your products from by lightest to thickest so anything that's like clear liquidy you want to put on first and then anything that is like creamy um, and thick you put that on last. So that's why it made sense to put the cream, the Daily Defense Cream on as a moisturizer because it's cream. Um, and this treatment was like a liquid. Liquid and it was like, um, you know, clear. It was a little yellowish. But the other things that I use, so I use the, the exfoliating cleanser first in the shower and then I, the true exfoliator, this is Pi. Um, and then I used the, my facial mist, and I'll use this all day actually, um, so that was number three, and then the, um, fourth thing was this, uh, and I would actually use the exfoliating mask before this if I was doing this at night, or if this is one of the days that I was going to use my mask, um, so this would be fourth or fifth depending on what day it is. This would be uh, fourth if I'm using it. Otherwise I wouldn't be using it. And then the my serums. Any of your serums that you like using. This one that I'm using right now is just particularly Olay. And it's the B3 Plus Hyaluronic. And then the next serum I'm using is the Tone Perfecting. B3 plus vitamin C, and um, then the daily defense. So this morning, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven pieces to my skincare routine. Um, it would technically be eight if I did everything, if it was one of those days that I needed to actually wear my mask. Um, probably even more depending on whether I use my little um, Neutrogena masks as well but I just wanted to show y'all that you can do you can take care of your skin with 
without spending a whole lot of time. The last part of my skincare routine is adding some sunblock. Again, this is Melaleuca. And I try to keep things that are very moisturizing around for my lips because I wake up with dry lips. And then especially after I brush my teeth, they be like, mm, super dry. But this is the Pina, Pina, Pina Colada Broad Spectrum SPF 15. So, I keep that in my pocket. I'm going to throw on my little dress that I'm wearing today. And um, let me wash my hands and wash my little dropper for my other thing. And uh, y'all have a happy Monday. Um, if you have any questions about any of the products that I'm using or you have any questions about my, my process, let me know. Okay? Talk to you soon.